Dexter, I know Coach said that part of us last week was getting, you know, ending possessions to rebound, defensive free percentage, not fouling. You feel like statistically in those, those things that y'all were looking at, this was a, a turnaround game from where y'all have been? Uh, most definitely. I think the coaches have put a lot of work in towards um, our scouting reports, ball screen coverages, uh, all of our defense just in general. And I think we definitely made uh, a step in the right direction tonight. Curie, for either one of you, um, what was the conversation like at second half, uh, at halftime? Because uh, you are down at the half, That's not running the away, and then you just completely dominated the second half. Uh, I mean, we weren't really uh, phased by it. We They had went on a little bit of a run uh, to end the half. And we was just talking about we're good. You know, we're going to come out in the second half, make sure we throw the first punch. And that's what we did. We came out through the first punch and built that lead up and was able to hold it for the rest of the game. James, I know uh, you all made some adjustments over this past week, Coach said. How do you feel like those set in uh, and, and made a difference in, in this game? Uh, huge difference because uh, guys bought into what he was saying and the rest of the coaching staff and laying down the plan and what we need to do uh, for each individual guy. And having everyone being focused on it and executing it, that's what you saw today. Do you feel like there was a little bit of a, kind of having to get into it a little bit in the first half? Is that maybe a difference between the second half and the first half and some of those new things? A uh, little bit, I think so. Because, uh, you know, we weren't used to seeing it in front of uh, different competition. Yeah, so we have turned it over more in the first half. Yeah. We had a lot of turnovers. Yeah. So um, we weren't really getting a lot of shots. They had more shots than us at half, too. So. Um, Normally, we don't turn the ball over. We at least get a shot out. We have a good chance of offensive rebounding. I think second chance points given has been kind of an issue. And they, they had five, and three of them came in the last two minutes. Why was that such a, you know, why do you think y'all made such a dramatic improvement in that regard? Um, I think it just go back to the coaches. Um, the I think the adjustments we may have taken us out of, were taken us out of long rotations, long closeouts. Um, <laughs> the closeouts are like, it's a really hard thing, if y'all know what I mean. If you go from one spot of court and you got a long one, it's really, really hard to, you know, contain the ball or whatever. So um, the changes that the coaches have made have kind of helped us in rebounding as well, too, not just ball screen coverage. What was the change? I, I really don't want to put it out there to the media. <laughs> Can't give up if you get what I mean, I don't want to just say it. You feel what I'm saying? If you ask coach and he tell you, then that's perfect. But I'm not going to tell you. Yeah. Respectfully. Julius, what's been the big difference for this team on the road and, and at home? Besides the obvious, I guess, being at home. Yeah, I mean, yeah, being at home is a different uh, feel. Uh, I feel like also we've uh, had a lot of time between uh, road trips and neutral site games where we can uh, kind of adjust to what we were doing wrong. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> adjust to what we were doing wrong. And um, that's, that time has helped us out, uh, knowing that we have a home game and we got to, you know, show up. And having the fans there, too, uh, supporting us, that's been huge, too. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what do you feel like uh, y'all were doing particularly well specifically to avoid uh, fouling while you're defending? Only nine fouls, I believe, total as a team. You got that? I'm sorry, can you repeat that? What do you, what do you feel like y'all were doing uh, defensively well to you know, defend without fouling? Uh, what led to that for you guys? Yeah. Um, I got it, you got it. Okay. I mean, yeah, it's just, it goes back to what we've been saying. Coach made the adjustments. We listened. Um, you know, a lot of guys weren't put in rotations. Uh, like you said, long closeouts. Uh, you know, limiting those long closeouts has helped us out. And, you know, we're not going to foul as much if we don't have to close out from the other side of the court. And um, having guys in, uh, staying in, the, in their positions has helped out a lot. And it showed today. Dexter, how do you feel like y'all, how would you grade y'all's uh, effort in uh, transition D in the first half, and how much did that change in the second half? Um, did we have a bad transition defense the first half? Uh, was it bad? Was the transition defense bad the first I, half? I can't remember. I'm a, sorry. I, they didn't really. I don't think they got any in the second half, really. Yeah. It, it definitely improved in the second half. Uh, well, I think a lot of things improved the second half. The first half, we kind of um, we started off really, really good, and they went on their little run. Um, yeah, they got a couple guys who can really shoot the basketball, and uh, I think like when we're hooked up on defense and we're uh, mano a mano, man on man, I think we're one of the best in the country and just guarding the ball. So um, when we try to do that as much as we can, and I think the coaches have really get all the credit in my opinion. Overall, do you think this was the response you guys were expecting after coming off of a loss and then having a week to prepare? Uh, most definitely. Uh, coaches have been doing a good job of just uh, making sure we're at least getting uh, better in some type of way every day, I say. and. Uh, 
he's been really, really consistent at that, just staying on us, staying on us, trying to improve our weaknesses as a team. Um, and also trying to get us better as players because once we get better, the team gets better in, you know what I'm saying? So um, all the credit goes to Coach. Earlier this week, Coach talked about wanting sort of not the defense to wait for, you know, shots are falling to start playing defense. He wanted the defense to kind of fill the offense. Do you feel like, especially at the start of the second half, that was sort of the mindset going in and y'all were able to stick to that? Yeah, I say that. Yeah. Um, I think – when we were, it's hard to go on the road because you know it's just it's it's tough environments. But one thing is that are not supposed to change is like defense and rebounding. You know that's just those are like effort things. You know what I mean? So sometimes the shots aren't going to fall, and that's cool. But uh, defense, toughness, and rebounding always travels. But yeah. Uh, for for either y'all, is this was this a good dress rehearsal for new stuff, or just kind of getting the next step forward in preparation for the game that y'all have next week, which is. Uh, an important one? I mean, I guess, man. I'm not trying to get too far ahead. Just trying to look, you know, one day at a time. Uh, going to close this window probably tomorrow, and then we'll probably get to Memphis and stuff like that. But I just, as long as we keep making progress, I think we're fine. Any other questions? Thanks, man. Thanks, man.